I'm extremely excited to open this box. This is the Pelican 1615 Air Travel Case. After reading the reviews and looking at the pictures, I could not be more excited to try this out for myself. So let's open up the box and see what's in there. I'll give you a quick look at the whole box. Nothing too crazy. Open it up, we've got the box in a nice plastic wrap. Oh boy. Okay. It's pretty big actually. In this case, um, as I mentioned, it is pretty big. It is the max size allowed by most airlines. It definitely depends on the airline, but uh, most of them should allow this case. This is the Ox blood color. There's also a blue color, tan, and then black. But I thought this color looked pretty sweet, so I went with that. Get rid of this sticker right away. So this is obviously a case that uh, you're supposed to fly with. Um, meant for that, so it is lighter. It's about 40% lighter than a case the same size of a different series from Pelican. So that is awesome. Without the organizers in it, it's about 16 pounds, and with the organizers that come with it, it's about 19 pounds. So let's take a look at this case. Yeah. So first, you got a big handle. Seems very comfortable. Rubberized. Seems very solid too. And we've got a similar handle up top, a little bit smaller, but they're all like kind of difficult to move up and down, which I love actually, better than it being all loose and flying around. So we'll snap that back down. Okay, also got the hinges here, which are covered in plastic, seem very sturdy. Seems awesome. What else do we got? Here we've got the pressure mechanism, which it does do it by itself, so we don't need to worry about twisting anything or um, making sure it's screwed in all the way before it goes in the water. It should be protected all by itself without us doing anything. Speaking of waterproof, it is IP67 rated, so it can be one meter underwater for about 30 minutes before anything will be getting inside your case. It's also crush proof and dust proof. So the perfect case for airline travel, I would say. As far as latches, the first one we got here is just a regular latch. Maybe, how does this work? Oh shit, you gotta push this button. It's been a tough day. Well, that's cool. So you push this button in first and then it's nice and easy. Huh, I'm sure glad I didn't break it. Look at that. So we've got this front latch here, then we've got two on the side that are the exact same. And then the ones on the front side are lockable. Work the same with the push button, but uh, the case comes with the key or I would assume it comes with the key. And these are TSA approved locks. So if they need to get access while you're at the airport, they'll have a key and they can get in easy with no problems. So opening the case up. Nice, pretty roomy. Yeah. So first thing we're seeing is the lid organizer. So we've just got some mesh pockets here. Seems to be good quality. I would hope so for the price. Um, yeah, so the mesh pockets here, then we've got a zip pocket, and that's just one big pocket all the way through. And we also have a bigger pocket there. So I feel like we could store a, a good amount of stuff just right in the top here. And I think we can take off this liner too if we want but this case with the liner and the cubes is also like a hundred extra dollars. So I don't know why you'd take this out. Okay. Yeah. Let me 
does come with the packing cubes. Yeah. It's just two cubes that uh, go inside here just to separate your clothes or whatever you're hauling. We also have those keys that I promised you. Don't wanna lose those. Don't put your kids in the case either. And then here's just a brochure from Pelican. Oops. All right. I will show you guys the inside. Yeah. This is what she looks like. Pretty big in there. As far as dimensions, I did mention that it's about the max of what most airlines allow for a checked bag. And the interior dimensions for this case are 29.5 inches by 15.5 by 9.38. So you should be able to hold plenty of stuff in here. Plenty for a, a week's trip or two weeks, definitely. So we will shut the case. This guy wants to hang in there. It's a very nice looking case, I must say. Seems like great quality too. And let's check out the outer stuff a little bit more. We've got the handle, which you just pull this little vise back here. Nice, so just treat it just like a suitcase. Seems very sturdy. Let's put that back down. And we've got the wheels on the bottom. I have read quite a few reviews in this case before I bought it and I know that they only have two wheels here to keep it lighter that way you can store more stuff so you're not getting over that 50 pound max for the airline people said that it needs four wheels and I'm guessing that they mean it needs another set over here to match the other bags that uh, are in the airport that you can kind of roll just like this and it goes like that rather than tilting it here. I don't see it being a problem, but I'm not real picky. I just want my stuff to be protected. So all in all, what I can say so far is it does seem like a very solid case. I feel like you can put some serious weight on her. Yeah, I'm a pretty heavy fella and it's not caving in yet. Which I'd be pretty pissed if it did. Um, but it seems like a very solid case, looks great. And as I mentioned, it is waterproof, crush proof, um, has the locks on the side, also a padlock spot here, if you wanna get extra wild. And yeah, seems like an awesome case. I feel like I'm definitely gonna lose those keys at some point, so that'll be interesting. It does have those three handles. So it's got the big one on top and then the two smaller on the side. And as far as latches, it's got the two on the side and then the three in the front. And also has a business card holder here. If you want to put your business card in there. I don't have a business, so I probably won't use it. But yeah, it's just a beautiful looking case. I love it. And one reason that uh, I got this case rather than the just plain old Pelican Air, the 1615, I chose to get the one with the organizers, is that even though it is about a hundred extra dollars versus the other one, this way I've already got the lid organizers, which I think is awesome because you can Put your toiletries in here, your phone chargers. Um, I normally bring my GoPro with me, so I can store all that stuff in here and just leave the main compartment for my clothing. And I figured if I was to get the cheaper model and I would just end up with some off-brand aftermarket thing that uh, I'd end up regret getting and just wish that I got this in the first place. So really pumped that I have that. And I'll open up the packing cubes or organizing cubes too to show you guys. Okay, so the first one is like this, pretty good size. Then 
then the second one is just a little bit smaller, it looks like. A little bit different shape. Nice handle there. And I will show them inside here to give you guys a good, well, not a great view. Yeah, I'll show you anyway. So it looks like they fit in really nice. Make a little bit more sense to show you if they were full of stuff, but they are not. I'm just excited to see this thing in the airport, uh, bring it around and see it go on the carousel. I feel like there's not a lot of colors like this or bags this color, so it should be easy to find. And I shouldn't have to worry about my, my things when I travel getting wrecked at all. Waterproof, crush proof, dust proof. Not much you can do to my things if it's in here. And I do fly quite a bit from Florida to Minnesota. So having this is gonna be absolutely awesome because there are quite a few times where they're loading your bags into the plane and it's either raining, snowing, or what have you. And this thing will protect all my stuff. If there's any tests that you guys want me to do on this case, or any questions that you have about it, I can definitely help you guys out with that. Just put in the comments and uh, I will do my best to try to help you out. And I will update you on my thoughts after using it for six months, a year, something like that. And uh, yeah, I'm sure it'll work great for me. I'm excited to use it.